shaded visage of George Patton. I prefer the one up in Hamilton. The hat shell. The array of statues to notables from the past. And lo, it's the Fiedler footbridge after dear old Arthur. And yet another example of Boston's never-ending wannabe nonsense. We have gondola tours. <laughs> like this is ever going to be Venice. Evidently it's a little early for gondolas. And then we have a crappy snack bar being upgraded for the age of the yuppie. I'm pretty much at my wit's end on this thing. I think you have a pretty good idea, faithful viewers, of what exactly is in store for you in the middle of this urban amenity. Here's a fun little playground that hopefully won't get your kids killed. Ooh, and it's a healthy heart trail. That's important in a city full of sclerotic alcoholics. <laughs> oh yeah, there's a nice glimpse of the little urn things that they like to put on these things, figuring we're like Rome or something. Or is it Athens? That's right, we're Athens. <laughs> the gondola tour, give me a break. Getting my Memorial Day weekend on. <laughs> what is this? An attempt to make Arthur Fiedler look like the Pharaoh? Oh. Boston, you just try too fucking hard. <laughs> and come up with zip. So there we have it. Esplanade Islets, the lagoon, the simulacra of a stupid gondola operation that fleeces the idiots who think Boston's so feasticated. I wonder what a ride on that thing runs you. Who knew that you could fleece idiots to flop around on some boat in stinking Charles Esplanade? Cormorants like it though. And so I take my leave of it all. I'll save a little bit of stuff. For Reverse bridge traverse. This little cool thing goes for another half mile, maybe that way. Mostly more of same. Gonna leave a little bit of mystery so that you'll explore it on your own. Water's a ripple.